the point that I want to make to you guys is, yeah, you guys should know, like obviously there's a couple ways you could do this in, in there. Now let's pretend you don't know the answer, right? Um, and you need to use this in your calculator. Well, first of all, we could easily just do the numerator divided by the denominator, right? And then take numerator divided by denominator, which in this case you can see is going to equal 1 half or 0.5, right? Mr. Allen. Uh, wrong room. So in here, this is the same case. When you have this law of cosines, simplify the numerator, simplify the denominator, and then divide them. Okay, because what a lot of people will do is they'll type it into their calculator like this. 1 plus 4 divided by 5 times 2. And I'm proud, unfortunately, that does not, your calculator is going to follow order of operations. It's going to do multiplication and division first from left to right. So what your calculator is going to do is 1 plus 4 fifths times 2, which is not equal to 0.5. Okay, so what you need to do is when you are typing this in your calculator, use parentheses for the numerator, then use parentheses for the denominator. Or just do numerator first and then do denominator, right? So you can follow the order operations yourself, but if you're going to plug everything on its own, the point that I'm trying to make for those people that are paying attention is make sure you use parentheses or just do it one by one, step by step. Does that make sense? Okay, that's a key mistake that a lot of people will make. All right, now 